The U.S. elections are coming up, so we've decided we're going to entertain a few ways that blockchain could potentially help prevent voter fraud. But before we dive in, we need to clarify what we mean by blockchain and what we mean by voter fraud. As you know, blockchain is decentralized digital ledger that records transactions across a network of computers and is designed to be secure, transparent, and resistant to any modifications. Voter fraud, on the other hand, refers to any illegal interference with the voting process, including things like voting multiple times, impersonating other voters, or tampering with vote counts. Now, let's take a look at how blockchain could address some common concerns in voting. Blockchain could create a secure, encrypted voter ID system in which each individual voter would have a unique digital identity that's nearly impossible to fake. Once a vote is cast, it's recorded on the blockchain. This creates an immutable record that can't be altered without detection. With this immutability, you could verify that your vote was counted correctly without compromising ballot secrecy. Because blockchain is decentralized, it would distribute the voting record across multiple computers with no single focal point for it to potentially fail or be manipulated. Blockchain allows and encourages continuous auditing of the voting process, making it easier to detect any anomalies. Yes, blockchain technology holds a lot of promise to improve voting systems and prevent voter fraud. However, for blockchain to realize that promise, there are still a few challenges. Let's consider a few of them. Blockchain systems are complex and require specialized knowledge to implement and maintain. This complexity could lead to difficulty in finding people trained and qualified to run systems, increasing the risk of configurations and errors. Not everyone has equal access to or understanding of digital technology, which could possibly disenfranchise some voters who are less tech savvy. However, blockchain as an immutable voting ledger could increase incentives for more extensive accessible voter education programs, which could also ensure that everyone has equal access to voting devices and internet connectivity. Obviously, implementing a blockchain voting system would be a major undertaking with high costs for developing secure, reliable software and purchasing hardware, in addition to expenses for regular system maintenance and upgrades. This challenge opens up opportunities that would improve the efficiency and security of the software and hardware required to support blockchain platforms. While blockchain can enhance security in some ways, it can also introduce risks in other ways. For example, there's the potential for 51% attacks if a single entity gains majority control of the network. There's also the vulnerability to quantum computing advancements that could break current encryption. And there's the risk that a bug in a smart contract could compromise the entire voting process. A focused effort to establish clear regulatory frameworks and processes to ensure the security of blockchain networks is essential. Implementing blockchain voting would require navigating complex legal landscapes, requiring new legislation with a firm understanding of blockchain-based voting and compliance standards consistent with existing election laws. This new legislation and compliance would most likely have to respect and adhere to the unique constitutional requirements of each individual country. Luckily, in the US, initiatives like FairShake, a bipartisan super PAC dedicated to promoting innovation and growth in blockchain technology, are working alongside industry leaders to create legal and regulatory frameworks. So, as we can see, blockchain presents some interesting ideas on how to improve some aspects of voter fraud. What are other ways that blockchain might be used to prevent voter fraud? What are some other challenges and how might we solve them? Let's continue the conversation in the comments below.